Hello. I'm speaking with you now in order to provide you with an update regarding the positive COVID-19 cases within our school community. Today, November 12th, we've been informed of an additional four cases of COVID-19. Three of these cases are students and one is a staff member. In total, we now have had nine cases since this weekend. As a result of these cases and in an effort to minimize the spread of the virus, Averill Park High School will stay in a virtual setting through Thanksgiving. We hope to return to our hybrid instructional model, which includes in-person instruction on Monday, November 30th. During the time that we are virtual, we still need parents to complete the health screening survey in order to monitor the safety and health of our students, which means you will still receive the daily reminder to complete the survey. We are also aware of a possible exposure in the community that took place outside of school. This event has also led to students being quarantined. We are asking that anyone who displays symptoms, self-quarantines, gets a COVID test, and notifies the school district that your child has been tested through our dedicated email address, which is COVID reporting, one word, at apcsd.org. This inbox is monitored by our co-directors of nursing. Furthermore, if a quarantine student becomes symptomatic, then any siblings of that student should also quarantine. And we ask that you notify the district through that aforementioned email address, which again is COVID reporting at apcsd.org. The district has been in close contact with the Rensselaer County Department of Health. Our county DOH has been an invaluable resource during this pandemic, and we thank them for their continued partnership. The county DOH has taken the lead on contact tracing and identifying individuals who may need to quarantine. Contact tracing for today's cases has not been completed yet, but we anticipate that all contacts will be notified as soon as possible. While we understand that you would like additional details, we are not permitted by privacy laws to identify students or staff members involved or to provide further details. The news does not affect students in grades K through eight. At this time, there are no positive cases at any other APCSD buildings. The district's three elementary schools will continue with in-person instruction and the middle school will continue to be in a hybrid model. Please rest assured that the district's priority is protecting the health, welfare, and safety of our students and staff while complying with federal, state, and local orders and guidance. We know that these are challenging times and understand the stress and angst that the situation has caused for our students, our families, our employees, and our entire community. I encourage you to reach out to someone if you need help in navigating these uncharted waters. To that end, our website has links to numerous resources, including for those who are experiencing food insecurity, who are in need of mental health assistance, or who are looking for emotional support. To access this information, click on COVID-19 Information and Resources from the District Information drop-down menu, which can be found on our homepage. Thank you for your patience and your understanding during this time and know that we will get through this together because we are Warrior Strong. Thank you.